Hello everyone, this is Bauman. Welcome to episode 1 of this Let's Play SCP Containment Breach. I have a bone to pick with this game. I have been playing this game for uh, many, many years now and I've never completed it. And I want to change that with you, together. And since it's booked over, I was like, yeah, this is, seems like a fitting situation. We are also going for Euclid difficulty, which means that we can only save when we are near a monitor. So, you know, no quick saving anytime, just at monitors. All right, here we are, into the terrors of this game. Look at these two poor fellas. <sighs> yeah, I did skip the intro sequence because, come on, everyone knows this game by now. Alright, let's do a savey here, and let's go. Keep your eyes on it. What if I blink? Blink. Blink. Hey, concrete man. No. Oh. Heard moving, but I don't know where it goes. Oh, whatever. So I think there's nothing in this first area here. Gate. Idiot. Also, who is this guy? He looks like a civilian. Why? What is? What does he? All personnel report to immediately. Okay, I will do that. We get a keycard in there, but we need a keycard to get in there. So I think we can get a level two keycard out of there. All right. Ooh, this is the infinite uh, passageway. Yes. Or the infinite hallway, whatever. I think it's explained. Oh, what is this? Oh, I think it's explained in here. No, it's not. That's something completely else. We'll get to that once we get to that. I'll take the battery though. But I don't think I will actually do this because the more you go, like the more you continue down this path, the more weirder stuff happens. Like items get changed in the inventory and I actually don't know all the consequences of this. So I'll just, I'll just stay back. Or maybe, if I find a monitor, we can go explore. Oh! Speak of the devil. Find a monitor, let's save, and let's uh, witness this infinite hallway thing. So we just keep going through this. And stuff should change in this hallway every couple of uh, walkthroughs, whatever. Also, I have to pay attention to my items because they can change as well. What? Okay. Let's keep on going. That's new. That's a big stain of blood right there. Very nice. All right. Stop with the sounds. Man, the sound design in this game is just so good. It's like 90% of the horror. All right. Can I, but if I close this, will it be closed in the next couple of rooms too? really creepy that uh, the containment breach is still going on and people are still dying around us. 
kind of crazy. Oh, door won't open. Oh, that, that's the doctor. <laughs> the plague doctor. Very cool, can't wait to meet him. Oh yeah, I forgot to change, uh, check my inventory. Oh! SCP-093 recovered materials. You gotta be kidding me with this. When... When I asked for a level 2 version of this, you could have just said no. What the hell, Dr. C? Supposed to give me some kind of idea what this means or it's a hint? I don't know what this is. Hey friend. You have a hole in the head. I don't know if you knew that, but just pointing it out. Nice. Nice sounds. It's in my head! Zombie! No? Okay. <laughs> Alright. Come on. You think you're creepy? Nah. That's probably because I already know this. <laughs> Just wanna show you guys. Oh, we got another new item. Strange note. Black, white, black, white, black, white, 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 black, white, 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 There's some more interesting in there. I see a gray at the very end, but maybe it's like the spiral, the downward spiral that this uh, this hallway is. The deeper you go, the black, white. I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Okay. What? what was the first part though? God damn. Okay. Okay. Alright. I don't know if we're actually fine once we're done with this. You know? I should probably load. Although it's the beginning of the game, so. Whatever. If I die after this, I die, I guess. We should start over. Nope. Oh yeah, I forgot. You're actually just there. Okay. Weird. You keep it up, buddy. You here? Wait. Don't mess with me. What? Stop! I'm going crazy, you guys. This is mildly concerning. Alright, I know there's one more phase to this. Uh, let's see if I can get this far. Oh, yep. There we go. That's normal. Yeah. So I don't think there's anything after this. I'm not sure though. I'll just keep going for a couple tens of doors. So, be right back. Well, I went through like 30 doors now. Or like 30 hallways. There's something on the ceiling. Uh, nothing really changed. Well, he started spinning, I guess. Hmm. Well, let's just move on, you know, pretend nothing ever happened. Oh, we can't really go through there without a gas mask. I mean, we can. But do I want to? You know what they say. YOLO. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck! I 
that's why you need the gas mask. <laughs> Subject D9341. That's us! Cause of death, fatal cervical fracture. The surveillance tapes confirm that the subject was killed by SCP-173. Alright. Very nice. So you are in there. Um... Are you though? Oh, you are. Okay. Well, the other way it is. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Nice. Wait, am I bleeding? Am I bleeding? Hurt that concrete man. Stop it. Please. God. Every time. Tesla gates are still really scary. Okay. Very loud ventilator. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. You see that fella there in the middle? That's a no. <laughs> Uh, maybe I will explain it later if we get uh, the information letter or whatever. I think the shortest way out is through the southeast wing. Follow me. Oh, hey. Hey, Concrete Man. How you doing? It's Concrete Man with poopy on his butt. Very nice. Okay, now we got the gas mask and a key card. That's very good. Uh, there's our friend the teddy bear. The whereabouts of SCP-1048 are currently unknown, though it is still believed to be somewhere inside. Subject is to be secured for containment, but any creation of SCP-1048 should be destroyed on site. Concrete man, I'm reading. Please. Unless further evidence warrants less extreme actions. No teddy bears are to be allowed inside to prevent any confusion or mistaken identity. So I think this dude can kind of clone himself if he uh, gets material or something. I don't know. Um, SCP-1048 is a small teddy bear approximately 30 33 centimeters in height. Through testing, composition of the subject revealed no unusual qualities that make it discernible from a non-sapient teddy bear. Subject is capable of moving of its own accord and can communicate through a small range of gestures. Yes. I think this is the dude, the teddy bear which we find in the, um, in the lockdowns. In between the light and heavy containment zone. Um, the more anomalous behavior of SCP-1048 was not observed until approximately seven months after it was originally secured. It is hypothesized that the subject is able to construct crude replicas of itself using various materials by a process that was that has yet to be observed directly by Foundation staff. Dr. Carver has suggested that SCP-1048 uses its endearing qualities to lull those around it into a false sense of security, allowing it to collect materials to produce these creations. Ooh. Currently there are three known creations of SCP-1048, designated SCP-1048 a b and c the nature of these creations has been in stark contrast to scp 1048s general behavior as as all have exhibited extreme violence towards humans what why why teddy bear so uh, aggressive just a teddy bear you still there concrete man hey concrete man Oh, this is... No, this is not. That's like one room where a dude... Falls from 
the ceiling. Excuse me, concrete man. Stop. 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 Everyone, stop. Are you still down there? Stop! <laughs> oh, my fucking god. Piece of shit. Such a cheap jump scare. Okay. Are you still here? No. I want that. Oh my god, you piece of shit. Stop. Concrete man, why you do this to me? We found a wallet. A wallet with quarters. Very nice. Oh stop! I hate you, concrete man. Stop! Stop! Everyone stop! I'm going this way now. <gasps> it's Machine Boy. Machine Boy can uh, transform items. We need a level 2 clearance. Okay. I know where to get one, but... Also, I wanna finish exploring this. Surveillance room. Level three or higher. Gotcha. Oh, here he goes. Yeet. Boy, he has he has seen stuff. Hey, what? Oh, oh, oh. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Oh, that's the uh, the storage area. Check. Really? Storage requires a level 3 clearance? Are you kidding me? Or maybe it isn't. Maybe it's something else. Um, I'm not too sure about it. Hello. Ah, <sighs> here we go. Oh, we can save here. Hey, you were at the security meeting this morning, weren't you? Don't tell me you skipped it again. And now you need me to give you this week's door code? This time it wasn't entirely my fault. I hadn't received my personal code for some reason and I had to get up there and get it myself. You have no idea how many hoops they made me jump through before they finally gave it to me. I can only imagine. This new security protocol is even more of a clusterfuck than the one before. Tell me about it. But anyway, the code? I don't want to go through the maintenance tunnels again. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't. Even to do that either um, don't tell me you actually went through the maintenance tunnels just to get past that security door yeah I did and I don't want to do that again that place is a maze and whoever designed it should be fed to 6A2 so the code 6A2 is like a big uh, reptile like monster which is also very powerful and he can talk too um, so the code? Actually, we are no longer allowed to send any security codes through the intranet, which you would know if you had been at the meeting. I'll stop by in an hour and tell you the code. This is getting ridiculous. Franklin apparently isn't familiar with the concept of encryption. I mentioned it at the meeting. We are not going to take any chances until this overload is over and everything is back to normal. I guess he has a point. He does. Anyway, I have some work to do now. See you in an hour or so. Um, so, basically they are telling us that we could skip the maintenance tunnel if we were able to open that security door. Yeah. So if we have a code, we can get through a security door. So we... The corner of your eye. Uh, so we can skip the maintenance tunnel. Which is very spoopy from what I recall. Hey, we got a radio.
Let's take I don't care. Stop. Stop. So, this dude. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. What's that code? Is that the code we need? I'll keep it. But basically, SCP-372 is the one dude in here. Which, since it's not really that exciting, he is just a dude that occasionally appears in the corner of your eye. Just to spook you. He's completely harmless though. He's a very fast dude. But completely harmless. Okay. Uh, let's save again here. I don't know why. But let's save again. Now let's get the level 2 key card and then I guess we call it an episode. Uh, I think I have to get back here. Concrete man, you still there? Are you still there? Nope. Well, <laughs> I won't put it to the test, that's for sure. Oh, we are at the uh, very beginning again. So we haven't been this way, but... Wait. Now I'm confused. That was the beginning area. Hmm. I think at first we went this way, right? Excuse you? What? Oh. <sighs> Damn, Tesla gates. Okay, that's a problem. Ooh, spooky! We need to go in here, so we kind of have to lure our friend in here with <laughs> this dude. Uh, Alright, come on buddy. Blank! Alright, so now we go in here. I think he reappears in there. Yep, there he is. Oh god. Oh no. Okay. This is bad. Go back. Oops. Ooh, scary. Okay, level two cop. Did it. Yes. Yes. All right. Stop with the noise. What was at the end of this here? Was it the gas chamber thingy? Yes, awesome. Oh, all right. I think this will do it for the first episode. So I hope you guys enjoy this. I will try to finish this. And I will try to not edit it as much. Come on, Bum. You can do this. <laughs> so expect more episodes. A lot more frequent. And yeah. Hope you guys have enjoyed watching me derping around. And as always. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a sweet day. And stay awesome.